Hello everyone and welcome. Thank you for being here today with me on Storytime 365. My name is Barbara and today I have the story called Hush Up and Hibernate about a little bear who is opposed to going into hibernation. This is a book that's been written by Sandra Markle and it's illustrated by Howard McWilliam. Mama Bear lifts her head and looks at red leaves dancing in the wind. I see winter coming, she tells her cub. It's time to hibernate. But Mama, Baby Bear says, I am hungry. Mama Bear grunts. I guess we can eat a little longer before we sleep away the winter. Side by side, they munch choke cherries until a flock of geese flies past. Mama Bear slowly lifts her big head and listens to their honking. I hear winter coming, she tells her cub. It's time to hibernate. But Mama, Baby Bear says, I am thirsty. So Mama Bear leads her cub through the woods and down to the lake. When a fish swims past, Baby Bear tries to catch it, but misses. I think that fish is in a hurry to hibernate, he says. Mama Bear snorts. Fish don't hibernate. Neither do the voles, the owls, or the rabbits. No fair, Baby Bear says. Why can't I stay up all winter? Mama Bear sighs. Because when winter comes, there won't be any choke cherries for you to eat. No grubs or bugs, no fish either, because the lake freezes over. Baby Bear stamps his feet. I don't care. I'll find food somewhere. Mama Bear says, there's another reason winter's not for baby bears. Hungry wolves don't hibernate. They hunt all winter long. So do mountain lions. They might catch you without me to keep you safe. You won't be with me? Baby Bear's jaw drops. Where will you be? I'll be hibernating, Mama Bear says, as she plods off. Baby Bear stays, but only for a minute, because looking around, he sees the woods is full of shadows. Could wolves be hiding there, or mountain lions? Baby Bear runs as fast as he can to catch up with Mama. When they reach their den under the big old tree, they crawl in and curl up but Baby Bear wiggles. Mama Bear puffs. What's wrong now? I can't hibernate, Baby Bear says. This bed is too hard. So the bears crawl out of their den. Mama Bear paws more leaves inside until snowflakes fill the air. Winter's here, she tells her cub. It really is time to hibernate. But Mama, Baby Bear says, I can't hibernate yet. I have to say goodbye to the fish, the moose, the owls, the rabbits, and the voles. I'll go fast and hurry back. Baby Bear trots off. Mama Bear charges to catch up, roars, enough! Then she nudges her cub back into their den and nose to nose with him says, now hush up and hibernate till spring. With the winter wind howling outside, Mama Bear and Baby Bear curl up side by side and hibernate. Snore, snore, snort, snort, grunt. Mama Bear, Baby Bear whispers in her ear, can you hear me? Mama Bear snuffles, what is it, dear? Is it spring yet? Thank you for joining me today for this story. Please remember to like and subscribe, and I hope to see you again very soon for another story. Bye.